We've all been told that smoking is bad for you, and if you smoke, you'll never be able to stop. But why is that? Why is smoking so addictive? Cigarettes contain nicotine, which is an alkaloid. An alkaloid is an organic compound found in plants that have a physiological action on humans. Poisons and drugs, such as morphine, are also alkaloids. Now, nicotine is made by several types of plants, including the tobacco plant, and is also produced synthetically. Apart from being a substance found in tobacco products, nicotine is also an anti-herbivore chemical, specifically for the elimination of insects, meaning plants have evolved to produce this chemical as a defense mechanism to kill off bugs that try to eat it, and today it's used extensively as an insecticide. But what happens when humans absorb it? Well, when humans, mammals, and other types of animals are exposed to nicotine, it increases their heart rate, blood pressure, heart muscle oxygen consumption rate, and heart stroke volume. These are known as pharmacologic effects. Other effects are raised alertness, euphoria, and a sensation of being relaxed. When our bodies are exposed to nicotine, we experience a kick, and this is partly caused by nicotine's stimulation of the adrenal glands, resulting in the release of adrenaline. This surge of adrenaline stimulates the body, and there is an immediate release of glucose or sugar. Now, indirectly, nicotine causes dopamine to be released in the pleasure and motivation areas of the brain. Dopamine is a brain chemical that affects our emotions, movements, and sensations of pleasure and pain. But what happens after you inhale tobacco? Well, after inhaling tobacco smoke, nicotine rapidly enters the bloodstream, crosses the blood-brain barrier, and is inside the brain within 8 to 20 seconds. Approximately two hours after entering the body, half of the nicotine has gone. The more nicotine we have, the higher our tolerance becomes, and we require higher doses to enjoy the same initial effects. As most of the nicotine in the body is gone during sleep, tolerance may have virtually disappeared first thing in the morning, and that's why many smokers say that their first cigarette of the day is best or strongest. As the day develops, nicotine has less of an effect because of tolerance buildup. Studies have shown that nicotine appears to improve memory and concentration, and experts say that this is due to an increase of acetylcholine and norepinephrine where norepinephrine also increases the sensation of wakefulness. So perhaps if you're addicted to nicotine, it's because you like the feeling of it relaxing you, or maybe how it gives you a pop of adrenaline, or even because you enjoy it waking you up. So there you have it, intelligence for your life that you can share with your friends. It's Steak Tartar. And want to learn more? I have even better videos coming your way. Then join us on YouTube and subscribe for your answers to everyday questions.